Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Bowtie Man here, and welcome to Resident Evil 2, Biohazard Resident Evil 2. Uh, this just got released today, and I'm super excited about it. Uh, I am also streaming this, as you can't tell, that's why there's a webcam. Um, and I actually accidentally started the game before I was ready. Uh, but th this is just the beginning. The only thing you missed is a truck driver hit a someone walking across the road in the middle of the night during the rain and he went out to go check and she uh he turned around and she started to rise that's it that's all you missed oh and we're playing as leon we'll uh we'll do claire redfield later anyway uh yeah we're playing as leon right now we'll do claire redfield later um and leon just pulled up to the gas station to fill up his car he's like oh, that's weird no one's around and then he saw the cop car and he heard a noise and that's that's where we are right now can i move are you telling me this entire time i wasn't clicked onto the game and that's why okay look around there's blood there's there's a lot of blood leading up into this direction. Hey? Alright. I'm gonna be completely honest. This is probably gonna scare the shit out of me a lot. Hello? Anybody there? Hmm. Something's not right. You all right? Don't move. I'll be back for you. Already, I'm not liking this. I don't have a gun. Nothing. Stop moving. Officer, you need help? Stay back, sir. I got this. Oh, that's gruesome. Oh, God. He should pull off his entire neck. Freeze! I'll shoot! Why is he... Okay, there he goes. Is he dead? I think he's dead. Yo, dude, this guy's been looking at chicks. Key. Uh, I guess we'll put it right there. Over, okay, that, all right, why is how you open inventory? He had pizza back here and he decided to open up on that dude's neck and the other dude's neck. Uh, this just threw us right on into it. This can't be. I think he's dead now. I'm sorry, dude. Uh, you, okay. Uh, using key items. When you need to use an item to unlock a door or solve a puzzle, select the item and then use it again. Holy hell! I don't have the bullets for this. 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 I don't have the bullets for this at all. Claire, run, run, Claire! Don't shoot! Get down! You alright? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later, when we're safe. Holy shit. 
Oh, wow, they did just kind of throw us right on into this, didn't they? And you still have yeah, zombies behind you, bro. Come on! Get in! Hold on. What was wrong with your Jeep? they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah, Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He's a cop, too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. Oh, are they going to have Chris in the game? More. Oh, please have Chris in the game. Raccoon City, home of Umbrella. They fucked everybody up. Everybody, welcome to Resident Evil 2. Oh, this is exciting. I'm excited. Yeah, I, I didn't actually play a lot of the Resident Evil games. The only one I actually really played was 5, and I wanted to play 6, uh, but I never got the opportunity to, even though I couldn't play it at any point. Um, those of you watching later on, if you were around for my Resident Evil 5 streams, you'll you'll know I was pretty good at that one. Um, this one. It's supposed to be a remake of the second one, I think. The, the second Resident Evil. Uh, I wouldn't know. I, I didn't play it. Ooh, I like that intro sequence. Resident Evil 2. Yeah, I, uh... I never really played any of the other games. I watched my mother play them. She uh, she loves Attention these games. Attention all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak, you are advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my god, this is so unreal. Police station. I don't remember fault. Chris being a cop. He'll know something. He was a star yeah, right. agent. What if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. I watched the uh, Game Grumps play the first one not too long ago. Uh, and I know they started the second one. I don't remember if they finished it. There's a zombie standing right there. I see him. Looks like we're walking from here. They're leaking gas. There we go, logic at its best. Claire! Claire, are you okay? I barely have any ammo. 
I don't think I can go that way. Shit. It's everybody. Oh god, can I not jump? Turned. I thought that would have been a thing I could have done. I don't have any ammo to turn around and kill all the zombies. There it is. The station. See, their biggest mistake was crowding everybody around in one area. Go to the police station. You'll be safe there. When in reality, they were not safe. And I'm just running past all of these zombies. not how I thought my first day would be. This was in the uh, trailer. This was the demo. Explore your surroundings. Hello? Is anybody here? Got a can of first aid spray. Awesome. Thing of bullets. Even better. I believe there's the infamous chest where you can store everything. Oh! Jill model? Okay, hold on. Uh, Samurai Edge Chris model handgun, 15 shot capacity, 9mm handgun, and customized with a hard steel slide and silver glided trigger for increased accuracy and ease of use. Jill model. Uh, customized with a smaller slide uh, stop to reduce catching when drawing. Uh, non-standard issue gun with problems that make it impartial for the p general public. Yeah, I think we're going to use, uh, I think we're going to use Chris's gun. Yeah. Reload. Yeah, that, that's better. That, that's better. Penis, penis. Awesome. Yeah, my mother loved these games, so there's a possibility. Health and recovery items. I might bring her uh, in to uh, play this in a little bit. Um. Oh, I, I need a knife for that. I remember. Uh. Keep out. Okay, yeah, everything really went to hell in a handbasket, didn't it? Oh, yeah, that's right, I can save. Let's go ahead and save. Ah, now that we got that done. There has to be someone here. Not good. David, Marvin, you there? I found a way out. It's in here. Send reinforcements. East hallway. I gotta find that guy. Do you now? Okay, how do I bring up uh oh, view map? There we go. Uh, making use of the map. The map screen is useful for more than just your current location surroundings, but it can also show you points of interest and items you have found but haven't picked up. Okay. The typewriter's right there. There's the item box. There are some things up here. I don't have any items for that. In the uh, in the demo, Leon was wearing his police uniform. Uh, that takes a key. I don't have a key. No idea. But it looks like uh, that seal right there is supposed to go in the statue. Another key. Bullets! 
Only five? Damn. Okay. Let's check over here. And then, I know where we gotta go next because, like I said, I did watch the demo be played. Is that another key door? That's not a key door. That's a key door, though. Ooh, a safe. I bet you not do that. Let, let's just not have that happen. I thought I would be able to hear something. I don't know why I thought I did. Oh, there's a paper over there. This is an herb. Uh, guide pamphlet. Welcome to Raccoon City. Did you know while we are the uh, yeah while we are the home of the pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation, Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long, rich history of its own. In this guide, we will introduce you to a few of the more unusual points of interest our city has to offer. Raccoon City Police uh, Station. What are those noises? Uh, the building in the center of town wasn't always a police station. In fact, it was a uh, was to be an art museum. Various features like the unusual clock tower with the goddess statue in the main hall remind us of a bygone era. Orphanage. Just a few blocks from the police station is an orphanage founded and run by the Umbrella Corporation with the help of generous donations from businesses and citizens alike. The building is known for its stained glass window, which attracts visitors from around the world. I don't like the fact that there's an orphanage owned by the Umbrella Corporation. There's something on the other side of that window. That's outside, I've just noticed. You can see the rain particles. Anyway, anything else I can grab? Grab a soda. Let's see, they got nothing good, it looks like. Nothing down here. Did I come down here for no, no reason at all? Does, does in fact look that way. I have no idea how long I'm going to make these episodes. Uh, I think the first one I'm going to stop at the 45 minute mark. And then continue on from there, uh, doing it in those same intervals. But we got to go over to the big sign that says "Keep Out." That's as far as that's gonna go. I'm not comfortable with this. I'm not comfortable at all. It's a fucking bloodbath. <laughs> and Leon, you are just all nonchalant about this shit. Okay. All nonchalant. Okay, that's water. I thought that was blood. Like that's the offices. If I didn't know any better, I'd say there's something on the other side of that door. No collectibles, nothing. You got this. Yeah, you got this, man. This doesn't look fucking creepy at all. Like 
There's a light switch right here. And a dead body. I don't like the ominous music that's going on here, and I think something's gonna bust that door eventually. Okay, now that I got the lights on, what now? Okay, is that all that there is to do in this room? Oh. <laughs> that wasn't loud or anything. Anything gonna come popping around to these corners? I like how the women's bathroom isn't boarded up, but the men's bathroom is. Cleaning in progress. Really, now. Do I even need to know what's going to come out of that one? Oh, first aid spray. Two things at first aid, okay? And I'm completely fine, apparently. She's not phased by any of this, are you, Leon? Jesus. Open up! Hurry! Open up! Open this goddamn door! I'm coming! I'll get you! Like, hold on. Hey, I'm here to help. Come on, give me your hand. I got you. Give me your other hand. Are you gonna turn? Yes. Grab that and go. Officer's notebook. Alright. Uh, statue, pedestals, three medallions, staircase, then elevator down to something, to the parking, and a way out. Oh! Oh! Okay. I'll have to remember that. I'm pretty sure I can go back and look at these. Things. I didn't know how to stop you. Okay, hold on. Okay. Aim at him. Fucking. Leon! Head! Aim for the head, Leon! Oh. Uh, you can't. I was just about to say you couldn't get in here! I ate those words pretty quick. How are you still able to get up? That was three bullets to the head. Four. Jesus! They're everywhere! Give myself some room. Come on. Come on, you bastards. Come on. Come on. And the boob. Come on. Yeah, 
don't think you're getting back up from that one. You, on the other hand, are not dead. Just for good measure. Oh, no, no. No! Wooden boards. Cool. Ammo. That's what I like to see. Back that way, back that way. Ah, oh, that's a fuse thing. Let's get back. Leon Kennedy. There was another officer. I, I couldn't. I couldn't. Here. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. Yeah, I did try to pull him out, and uh, he kind of kinda this? died. Not a clue. But honestly, all you need to know is that this place will eat you alive if you aren't careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. Now he's got his police uniform on. Okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully you'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. Hmm. This is good news. We can get you to a hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. Now, you'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. Him. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, Uniform or not, you do not hesitate. You take it out, or you run. Got it? Yes, sir. <laughs> you are not going to make it. I'm sorry to say that. I mean, he doesn't stand a chance. Not at all. And I got a combat knife. Uh, well, yeah, we'll put it right there. Uh, right bumper plus right trigger. Okay. Alright. Anyway, let's go get the first medallion, and then I think I'm going to end the first episode there, and I'll be right back for the stream. Don't do that shit. Alright, so how do I check? Uh, officer's notebook... Lion, uh, branch bird. Uh, lion, branch, bird. Got the lion medallion. Cool, we'll put it right there. <coughs> Sorry. I'll go put it in the pedestal. Oh, no, the lion. Oh, hold on. Hold on. Wait a second. Let's go back. Um. Okay. Okay, no, that's just a different statue. I guess these can go anywhere? Guess it automatically goes Spilly to that one. Right. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, but the passage isn't open yet. No, it's not. All right. Let's go save the game, and then I'm going to end the episode off there. Yeah, 
Oh, it's over right there. I haven't messed anything up yet. Alright. So, yeah, that's going to be the end of the first episode there, guys. Thank you all for watching. Hope you all enjoyed. If you did, let me know because I'm, I want to keep this going. If you guys don't want me to keep this going, let me know. Though I don't think I'll get very, very many arguments considering my upload schedule is almost non-existent as it is. But this, this is something I want to I wanna put out. So, uh, if you guys did like, like what you saw here, don't forget to subscribe for more better content from me and everybody else I record with. Also, check out the Twitch channel where I will be streaming this as much as I can so you can see everything that's going on as it happens instead of like a few days later. Uh, I'm going to be doing maybe about three more hours of this, so you'll have maybe about four videos out of this uh, as soon as I possibly can. Uh, with that being said, guys, later.